that motivates me every day to to be able to call, you know, friends of mine who I know are very talented, uh, who probably normally wouldn't have gotten the opportunity to display that talent uh, if uh, the head of the department isn't someone that looks like them. Oh man, being on the other side of the camera looks so weird. <laughs> What's up everybody, my name is Kevin Spence and I'm a cinematographer based in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Well, like many of us who started out in this industry in the, in the mid to late 2000s, you had to be at that time what they called a predator. And that was somebody who could shoot, produce and edit their own content. And that is kind of like the basis for kind of getting your feet wet and, and uh, understanding what it takes to be a content creator. During this time, I was also a still photographer. At that time, I didn't have a reel when I wanted to start finding jobs as a cinematographer. So what I did is I dedicated probably about a good year into capturing images by myself. So while I was transitioning from a being a still photographer into a cinematographer, I would walk the streets and just film everyday life rather than take stills of everyday life. That started allowing me to understand the concept of uh, what motion should look like. My artistic and creative process is usually two, two things. One is the first thing is just consuming other creative content. You know, I don't watch television the same anymore, you know what I mean? I, I kind of just like find myself always pausing a frame just so I can figure out what their lighting diagram was. I, I love watching other creatives create. You know, I spend, you know, countless hours on Vimeo and, and YouTube and, you know, I find myself always binge watching shows that I really enjoy and love. And part of my creative process is writing things down, writing down ideas, writing down things that I, I haven't visually seen yet, right? Because I think that the other part of my creative process that allows me to grow is finding the time where I'm not consuming other creatives work, right? I, just really just kind of just focusing on what do I see in my mind? What do I see? What is my vision telling me? Uh, one of the things that motivates me the most about being a filmmaker and a cinematographer is knowing that I did not enter this field traditionally. You know, I, I don't have a formal education on being a filmmaker. I didn't go to film school or any trade school that taught film. And you know, I know that I have to work a little bit harder. That's a huge motivation every day to wake up and to, to really do the homework. I'm also super motivated by just being able to hire black people. <laughs> being a cinematographer and head of the camera department, I, I'm able to give jobs to, you know, oftentimes marginalized individuals in the industry. And that's a responsibility that motivates me every day to be able to call friends of mine who I know are very talented, probably normally wouldn't have gotten the opportunity to display that talent if the head of the department isn't someone that looks like them. I think that is, for me, the, the proudest moment that I have as a filmmaker, and I think that really like sparked the light that I needed to go even harder from that point. And my advice to young filmmakers, collaborate. <laughs> to me, that's gold right there, man. Get the homies together, man, and shoot that thing that you guys have been talking about, that short that you uh, said uh, is a great story to tell, that comedy sketch that you guys laugh about, you know, why you just hanging out, and, you know, or, you know, at dinner or at lunch or something. You know, I think that that is a true powerful tool is collaboration. And when you have the access that you that you can have now to the community that you have, I think that there is a direct path to exploring maximum creativity with with no holds bar, with no corporate companies or ad agencies looking over your shoulder to, you know, direct you into what they want. You in this moment have full creativity into doing whatever it is that you desire. So I say that, you know, collaborate with your community of filmmakers that you have access to it and just be free. 